Andy, 0-0 here today at the game. What's your thoughts? Um, I think credit to the two teams for sticking at it. I think very tough conditions, uh, windy. Uh, the pitch was bobbly and, and very tough to get the ball down. Um, but both teams stuck at it. Uh, for us, I think it's a, it's a good point because Farsley have been on a fantastic run. Russ has done an, an unbelievable job with them. Um, you know, he's, he's, his budget's you know, one of the smaller budgets in the league, so fair play to fair play to him, and and they really are working hard for him. And you know, if you haven't got that desire today um, and that togetherness, then you're going to crumble, whichever team. And both teams had massive desire to to get something out of the game. So, yeah, you know, pleased with the effort and the, and the work rate. Maybe at times our quality could have been better, um, but they're a tough side. I think they've won the last three at home. They beat Kings Linear, they're in the quarter final of the, of the trophy. They're on a fantastic run. Um, and we're on a real good run away from home. If you have a look at our last eight games, if you just look at the teams, you'd think going unbeaten is a fantastic, fantastic effort. You know, and we were down to the bare bones uh, today. Um, and Arv has gone in and played in the centre midfield and done fantastic for us. You know, it's not a game for Shents normally, um, but, you know, he's stuck at it. So. Yeah, yeah, really pleased. Um, but I think I think credit for both teams to, for, for their desire to to not fold on a day like today. I'm talking about we're down in the bare bones. You know, we noticed with the bench today we had Harry Scarborough who's come back from Brig, and also young Harrison Kay. He's one of the lads from the youth teams. Yeah, yeah, both of those. You know, uh, young lads, and obviously we had Drenchy on the bench as well. So it just shows we look we're, we're stretched at the minute. You know, financially we can't bring anybody in as it stands. This is why these next three home games are so important. You know, if if they want, if the fans want us to, you know, and I'm not talking about the ones who turn up week in week out, those little floaters who pick and choose the games. If you know, if they want us to be up there challenging at the end of the season, then it makes a massive difference. You know, 100, 200, 300 people on the crowd will, will make a massive difference for us. So. We need them the next three games, and then hopefully, then you know we'll we'll have a little bit of money then to maybe maybe strengthen. But um, you know we we put ourselves in a, in a real strong position with three home games to come after the after the three away games so to be unbeaten going to Blythe, Brackley, and Farsley is a massive effort. Tuesday night, we've got Kidderminster. What, what do we want from the fans really? Well, we just we just need that back, and when you know when they get behind us, it, you know it's a, it's a look, it's a horrible place to come to. It's a tough place, you know, and and that's down to the fans and the, and the way they get behind the team. Um, but we need more numbers, you know. It's it's just, it's probably just a lack of numbers. It's that's that's hurting us at the minute. Can't do any more where we are, you know. We've been been fighting in that top seven, you know, and I'll say it because it's true. You know, we're punching above our weight again. Um, you know, we're fighting against team, you know, you look at Kurt, what Curzon have done over the last, you know, got gone and signed Jamie Spencer from here, you know, and and they're like in the bottom half of the table, you know, and you just wonder how are they doing it? And we're, we're fighting every, every week, um, you know, to keep things and maintain things. So the crowd and, and the people at Chorley need to get behind us. And I keep saying it, um, we keep performing, we keep getting results. But we, we, you know, we just need more through the gate, you know, and it's it's as simple as that. And if we do that, I, you know, I really think we've got a good chance of getting promoted.